Hello. How are you all doing? Happy Sunday. It's a good day because it's literally not Monday. Welcome to the channel. If you're new here, so am I. So let's get rolling. This week will be fun. Way more fun for all of you watching this than it will be for me going through it. Wanna know why? Because it's just going to be a week in uh, the life of me struggling <laughs> because it'll be the first week of second semester of medical school. And for my program, that means organ systems. We start with heme lymph. And as much as the second, third, and fourth years tell me that it's gonna be fine, I don't think it's gonna be fine for me. I think it's gonna be a hot mess. So we'll see how it goes. Today's Sunday, classes start 8 a.m. tomorrow morning. Wish me all the luck, cross, cross all your fingers. Cross, cross all your, English. Rewind, it might be fine, but it'll be like messy, you know? I'm all about being unfiltered on here and just kind of like laying it out for upcoming students to see and for current med students to relate and laugh at, so. <laughs> It's just gonna be a ride. Let's go. No, no. Oh, too hard. Yes. No. Whoa, it's only a Monday. This is a Friday song. All right. Starting school on a Monday should be illegal. Like Mondays are bad enough. So this is my super study setup. And I've got my water and my LaCroix, which I love, even though everyone else I know hates it. I don't care. So this is where I'm at, you know, most of my day. And then I have my whiteboard and a plantito. So I have my lecture tracker. Let's see, so here we've got Neoplasia pathology. All right, I've got my first aid, got my board and beyond videos. As I go along with the lecture for today, I just add in the notes so that by the time I'm done with all the organ systems, all the first aid will be filled up with all the important stuff that I'll need to know for step one, hopefully. Teratoma, I can have like skin and hair follicles and muscle and cartilage all up in them. I found out that teratoma comes from the Greek word terra, teraton, like peloton, but terra, which means monster. So let me look one up. They're so cool. Thanks, babe. Every med student gets to have someone make food for them all the time. She does. I do. Lucky me. So this week is all kinds of weird already. Who thought of the word squamous? Really squamous? S Squamous? Hmm. Anyone else think that word's weird? Is it just me? Hello, baby. Hi. Oh. Oh, puppers. Recap, woke up at 6.15, which isn't super normal. I just like to like try to start off my weeks all like gung-ho. It usually does not end that way by Friday, but I try. I try on Mondays at least. Worked out, hung out with the doggos. Tanner made pancakes actually, which was fantastic. His pancakes, they're like banana protein pancakes with sometimes chocolate chips if I'm lucky and blueberries on top with almond butter. And I don't know, it sounds crazy, but it is delicious. And pretty much since then, since like 8 a.m. sharp, been in you know classes and stuff, although I'm still trying to figure out how to study for these organ systems. It's gonna be a process. That's all. I had the fortune of not having to start class until 9.20. Regardless, it is a day a la babe because i steal all of his sweatshirts and he is okay with it <laughs> shrugs <laughs> oops and the answer is this is severe dysplasia do you have a uh, nevis come here. Here. 
I have a nevus. No, I know what that is. I guess it's also a mole. Is the plural of nevis, nevi, nevises? Ah! <laughs> it is nevi. They're also called beauty marks. You hear that? They're all what is that song? I got a, I got a dollar, I got a dollar, I got a dollar, hey, hey. I got Nevis. I got Nevis. I got Nevis. I got Nevis. Can you get a brush? Can you get a brush? You don't have a lot of hair, babe. Well, I'm sorry that your hair is such a drag. It is. Welcome to the club. I'm gonna shave it. Don't you dare. Happy Tuesday. My favorite at the end of the day. Yay! Ooh. Holy Moses! Oh, food! I still have to do laundry. actually have marks on my nose where my glasses have been all day. Oh. Yeah, today was rough. It's Tuesday night. I'm just gonna wash my face while I uh, kind of give a lowdown on what today was. I completely ignored my alarm. Worked out real quick. Whew. Except now I'm sore already, so you know tomorrow's gonna be even worse. Had a mandatory like lab for pathology, which was interessante. How do we do a lab, you ask? In quarantine slash COVID? You don't really, actually. Uh, it's mostly like either straight lecture that's less lecture-y or lecture plus like some activity mix. Today it was the former, mostly just lecture, but a little bit better because it was less dense and uh, more pictures. So kind of like pathology for kids. What else? Lunch. Played a lot with the doggos. Usually they sleep all day, but they were not that sleepy today. So we did a lot of snuggles. Then had a wellness session. I mean, I'm glad we have them, but it was two hours long. Sometimes I think my wellness would be better served by using those two hours not on Zoom. Maybe that's just me. Faculty and administration, if you're watching this, love you. After lunch, went straight back to studying because there's a bunch of stuff from yesterday that I did not get or did not understand or just needed to look at more. It happens more often than I care to admit, but here I go admitting it. Usually we'd be doing stuff with friends, but everyone's either home because everything's online. So like across the country, like no one's actually here or we just can't do much because if you're not living with somebody then you probably shouldn't go like hanging out with other people is kind of the unsaid rule that students kind of live by at this point so it would be nice to hang out with people again i miss our friends we have a lot of really good friends we have a really cool student community so i do miss them a lot but you gotta do what you gotta do with that i'm gonna go to sleep Bye -bye. I just barely woke up and eat and I need to start class. Okay, well, not a great start to my Wednesday, but here we go. Oh, shh, just dropped my thing. Learning about anti-cancer drugs.
I'm all about motivational t-shirts. Just kidding, this is the only one I have. Thanks, mom. serious i swear if you broke he might have broken our washing machine with soap i did not need this on a wednesday see the states okay i'm gonna oh, go over here awesome. tunisia is that how you say it tunisia dude look i'm gonna keep zooming in and then i'm gonna click on this little guy go in there <gasps> look at that oh look at that oh my gosh this is the Mandalorian set? Dude, Are you kidding me? Totally is. Look at that. Oh, how did you even find this? Dude. What? Skill. So it's hump day. Good. Oh no. It's fine. We're good. Wednesday means that uh, tomorrow's Thursday and the next day is Friday. So uh, that means that the worst part of the week is done because Monday is usually comically lecture heavy. I'm talking like up to eight lectures a day. Monday, Wednesday are fairly lecture heavy. And then Tuesday, Thursday is like, like mandatory classes for like wellness and research. It's not like the heavy, heavy you know, material that we're going to be tested hardcore on every five weeks. It's more of the, the other stuff that goes into a medical school curriculum. So I realized, ooh, <laughs> quite the flip. Most of the videos have been just kind of funny thing but really here um, I'll, I'll just give you kind of a rundown a more grounded view of what's been going on because most of the time it's just been studying and i'm not gonna take a bunch of videos of that because it's boring so i'll be i'll be honest though today was really frustrating i don't know why but felt like i've been off my groove didn't feel like i was very productive even though i look back and i'm like oh, i actually got it i did quite a bit but like I don't know, I think throughout the whole day, I was just kind of like, oh my gosh, I'm really like going so slow through all this stuff. But I mean, it's fine. You have, you have off days and you have on days and you can't be too hard on yourself. You know, like if I were really hard on myself about every single day, like if I had a really strict to-do list about every day and I like beat myself up big time for not getting it all done and not understanding every tiny thing, I would never make it through school. So like pre-meds and incoming med students, like, Perfectionism, it will not serve you well in med school. It's rough on some days and it's great other days. So those are a couple of things that I wish I'd known more fully at least before starting med school. I swear, if I hear one more word about pharmacology or adverse drug reactions, I'm gonna... a.m. Sharp. And you I love non-mandatory so sessions where I can just from, listen. One good thing about everything being online is you never have to like worry about getting ready in the morning. You can just roll out of bed onto the couch. Happy Thursday. Is it too much to ask to to get a decent burrito on the side of the country? Oh. Isn't she so cute? I use Anki. If you aren't familiar with Anki, I would suggest getting familiar with it, deciding if it's something that you want to use. I don't miss Anki. Like when I opened that sucker back up after three weeks of not using it, I was so triggered about, I don't know. I decided I'm just gonna wing it. Yeah, wing it. Yeah. You have to become a <laughs> ski bum, you do. Ski bums? <laughs> do they even have ski bums in Michigan? Today is a definition of a lazy Friday. Woke up at like nine. Was on Twitter for like an hour. I don't even have classes. They're all non-mandatory today, so that's why Lazy Friday works. And I might spend most of today editing this. I feel like doing that more than learning about hemoglobin. So here's the game plan. Happy Friday. Watch this. Maddie, Martin.
Want a treat? <laughs> oh, you did so good. Come here. Ah! <laughs> Ow. Hello. You're on my hair! My hair, ow! Ow! Today is like gross, mushy, slushy. It just feels like I wanted to roll up a little burrito, a blanket, and not do anything. So, I won't be doing school today. I just don't feel like it. I'm not motivated for it today, and that's fine, honestly. I've come to realize that if I just give myself a little bit of a break, I come back way stronger and I'm way more efficient in my studying. I'm way more productive. Breaks are important so today i'm taking that break and i'm just gonna edit this video and because that's what i feel like doing and if i feel like doing a little bit of studying later tonight i will if i don't i won't and that's fine just finished working out and i gotta get ready because i got a couple of meetings i'm gonna get back to video editing i feel like i have been videoing little bits and pieces of random things but it's like no one wants to see a, a 40 hour video of me just studying and that's what i'm doing most of the day monday it was like 12 to 13 hour study day 10 to 11 on tuesday wednesday about the same 10 to 11. yesterday was a little bit less because i had long mandatory classes eight hours yesterday and today i mean I, I might do a little bit tonight but so far i haven't done any school so it's kind of like you choose your own schedule especially right now with covid and managing your own schedule is nice i feel like more brownies but i know i shouldn't you recording <laughs> Unfortunately. Bedtime. Thank you. Oh. Pre-meds, med students out there, please do not be shy. What do you want to see? Comment at me. Find me on Instagram or Twitter. Hey Marls is my handle. If you have not watched the intro video, Go look at it real quick. I'll link it there. And I just wanna say thank you to those of you who are currently subscribed. I appreciate you guys. It means a lot. And I hope that if you're a pre-med and found this helpful as far as getting a peek into the life of a med student, or if you're a med student and you just found this relatable and hopefully laughed a little bit, go down, show me you liked it, hit the like button, subscribe, comment, Tell me what else you want to see more of in the future. This channel is for you. Remember, I'll be putting out new videos every Saturday. So be sure to put on the notifications so that you can see when that comes out. So what you'd be subscribing for is not only more content like this, where it's like day in the life, week in the life, real time reactions to things as they happen in medical school, but also you're subscribing to a more structured style videos with valuable advice that I desperately wish that I'd had before going into and starting med school. I'm sharing all of this as I go along because this is all stuff that I didn't find and didn't know beforehand and I really, really wish I had. With that, thank you guys so much. I'm very new here, but I'm excited to share a lot of stuff in the future because there's a lot that I really wish I had known and a lot of funny things that happen as part of med student life. So hope to have you next week for the next video.